the New South Wales State Emergency Service were also a tri-party or a sponsor to this joint venture with UTS and TPG. There was actually also a separate project with the New South Wales SES on intelligent flood and storm management, which utilises this same technology. What we heard from the emergency services was that they don't actually have the capacity to look after and maintain physical sensors. And that's the way we traditionally sense the environment around us when you think about it. Sensors are generally physical devices that have a lot of upkeep and maintenance and there's also a cost to that. What's exciting about something like the TPG UTS Network Sensing Lab is the mobile network already exists around us. Yeah, right. We're just using it in a different way. There's a dual use for this mm -hmm. and we're using it as a sensor. There is no maintenance or upkeep that is an additional to the maintenance and upkeep of the network in general. It's a green way to sense the environment around us. So it really is the way forward and it can supplement our physical sensors in places that are geographically difficult to reach and very vast areas. So this would be excellent in more regional areas as well for sensors. Yeah, 